analyst outlines three reasons why U.S. doesn't want India to buy Russia's S-400 Ekaterina Blinova while India is pushing ahead with the purchase of S-400 Triumph, Russia's cutting-edge air defense system. The U.S. has a number of reasons to blow a fuse over the deal, Rakesh Krishnan Simha, New Zealand-based journalist, foreign affairs analyst and military observer, told Sputnik. Speaking to Sputnik, Rakesh Krishnan Simha, journalist, foreign affairs analyst and military observer has explained why Washington is deeply displeased with New Delhi's acquisition of the Russian-made S-400 air defense system. Widely acknowledged as the world's most powerful anti-aircraft and anti-missile system, the S-400 is a development of the S-75 missile that famously shot down the American U-2 spy plane over Russia in 1960. Its potency is the reason why countries like China, India, Turkey and Saudi Arabia are lining up to buy the missile defense system. With a tracking range of 600 kilometers, the ability to destroy hostile aerial targets at a range of up to 400 kilometers and altitude of 30 kilometers at a blistering speed of 17,000 kilometers an hour, the S-400 is a truly lethal air defense weapon, Simha emphasized. However, the U.S. has signaled that it does not welcome the S-400 D-linked by Moscow and New Delhi in 2016. Read more, there is a lot of concern in the U.S., in both the administration and the Congress, over the S-400 system, Chairman of the U.S. Armed Service Committee Mac Thornberry told the press in late May as quoted by the Hindu. There is concern that any country and not just India that acquires that system will complicate our ability to work towards interoperability together. According to the media outlet, Thornberry added that these concerns were separate from Washington's sanctions imposed on the Russian defense industry under the Countering America's Adversaries Through Sanctions Act, Public Law 115-44, CAATSA, in August 2017. Earlier, U.S. lawmakers protested against Ankara's acquisition of the Russian-made air defense system. Their wrath was understandable given Turkey's NATO membership. Besides, American policymakers believe that simultaneous exploitation of S-400 and U.S.-made F-35 stealth fighter jets by Turkey may expose both secret capabilities and vulnerabilities of the new warplane. However, India is not a NATO member state and has no appetite for procuring Lockheed Martin's F-35. So, what's the fuss about then? According to Simha, there are several reasons for it. Copyright Sputnik, Ilya P. Talifram left, soldiers from India, Russia and Angola take part in training sessions during the International Army Games 2015 at the Alabino Training Center in the Moscow region S-400 to further strengthen Russian-Indian defense ties. The S-400 is a rare example of a non-nuclear missile that is virtually a strategic weapon. Such mega deals bind the seller and buyer into a strategic embrace for the life of the weapon. Considering the longevity of Russian air defense missiles, in the 1990s the Serbians shot down a U.S. stealth fighter with a 30-year-old Russian SAM, the S-400 could remain at the heart of India's missile defense network for decades. Since the U.S. is attempting to pry away India from its defense partnership with Russia, the S-400 is one of the top obstacles to the U.S. plan, the military observer underscored. On the other hand, many nations follow India's lead when it comes to big-ticket weapons purchases, Simha noted. According to the journalist, the Indian military forces are known as picky buyers who put weapons through years of user trials before acquiring them. So the American worry is that once India acquires the S-400, it will have a domino effect on other nations that have historically bought U.S. weapons, the journalist highlighted. However, after India inked the S-400 deal, a number of pro-American nations such as Saudi Arabia, Qatar and Turkey approached Russia, copyright Sputnik, Ruslan Krivobonide launch of S-400 Triumph missiles from an anti-aircraft weapon system at Ashuluk proving grounds during an aerospace defense forces tactical drill a game changer in South Asia second, the system may potentially have an impact on Pakistan's defense and the balance of power in the region, Simha presumed citing long-standing ties between Washington and Islamabad. The S-400 will have the effect of turning a defensive system into an offensive system, and extend India's A2-AD anti-access area denial umbrella over the territory of Pakistan as well as on China's fringes, the analyst underscored.
The air defense system will increase the vulnerability of all Pakistani air assets, especially fighter aircraft, cruise missiles and drones, by several orders of magnitude. Due to their massive 600 km tracking range, and a 400 km kill range, just three S-400 battalions located on the border will cover all of Pakistan, except the largely barren western extremity of the rest of Baluchistan province. According to the military observer, the potential deployment of S-400 on the India-Pakistan border may tip the balance in India's favor which does not play into Washington's hands, after all, the Pakistani military continues to have strong links with the Pentagon which is a Cold War relic, he suggested. The U.S. does not want the strategic balance in South Asia to become one-sided towards New Delhi, Simha opined. Despite its professed friendship, the U.S. views India as a long-term economic rival with a totally different worldview. Copyright Reuters, Gary Cameron, file photo a Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II fighter jet is seen in its hangar at Pedux and River Naval Air Station in Maryland, U.S., October 28, 2015 An effective counter-stealth weapon Third, the S-400 is also an effective counter-stealth weapon, Simha stressed, suggesting that the proliferation of S-400 systems around the world will expose the F-35 stealth fighter's weakness. The military observer highlighted that, there is no such thing as, stealth, aircraft for the Russian-made air defense system, referring to reports unveiling the S-400 outstanding military capabilities. The latest American jet has been highly controversial because it has been slammed by a number of aviation experts as being underpowered, underarmed and not stealthy at all, the journalist underscored. The S-400 could further expose the F-35's shortcomings and leave the entire U.S. defense establishment red-faced as all families of American jet fighters will eventually be replaced by this single stealth jet. The views and opinions expressed by Rakesh Krishnan Simha and Ekaterina Blinova are those of the contributors and do not necessarily reflect those of Sputnik.